you so much for coming. Absolutely. Woo! My name is Yusef, and I'm one of the co-founders of Boost Hungry. I also like to start this off by asking you guys one question. Have you ever had an eagle on? Have you ever been this person? <laughs> well, I have, and it sucks. But the fact of the matter is, it's because of things like this. This is a group text of people trying to meet up for lunch. As you can see, what happens quickly is really important details get lost. Things like, when are we going? Who's going with us? And where are we going? Now, couple that with your bunch of your indecisive friends, you'll find yourself sifting through messages just to figure out what's going on. Now, we looked into this a little bit further, we found that 70% of students are dissatisfied with this process. 70%, that's so many. And as students ourselves, we really take this to heart. When you think about K-12, we've always had a half an hour in between lunch, taking with your friends, and de-stress and joke around. Why does it have to change? Why does it have to be that way? Well, who's hungry? We think there's another way, and we want to show you how. First, we decided we want to meet up at breakfast, lunch, dinner, even drinks. Next, we decided the time, and then you suggest three friends for your place, three places for your friends to vote on. Next, you invite your friends. You invite your friends who are on the app, friends directly from your contacts. You can even make custom groups so you can invite multiple friends with just one vote. Now, after this, we arrive at the vote screen, where you can see who's going, who's not going. You can see what restaurants people are voting on, and the times people are trying to meet up at. Now, you can see our app providing a lot of value for other user segments, but we decided to focus on college students because of our deep connections at UT. And that is 17 million strong in the United States alone, college students. 1.5 million in Texas, and 50,000 strong in UT. Okay. <laughs> now, there are a lot of other competitor apps in this meetup space. The fact is, our biggest competitor is text. 95% of people use texting and calling to meet up with their friends. Well, we plan on approaching this market by influencing the student leaders on campus. This was a tactic that was used by the app Geek Cap, I'm sure many of you might know, and proved to be very successful for them, gave them a very low user acquisition cost. Now, you might be asking yourself, how are we going to make one? And the fact is, also, why is Hungry Hungry Hippo photo on the screen? Well, if you can imagine this right now, the space for restaurants is, imagine each one of these hippos a restaurant, and the marbles, customers. This is what it's like right now for restaurants trying to get at consumers. There's no target, there's just general advertising. Well, we envision a 